What's up guys, Mardi Gras Man 23 and today I'm going to bring you my next Sig Fig Mock Float. That's right guys, I've got a new float. This is float number three. And who do you guys think it is? Who do you think I took off of my Sig float and gave them their own float? So who's up next? You guys want a hint? How about that? You know who it is now? That's the Octan car. Any ideas? Well, let's just get right to it. Who is it? It's Bricks for Chris. Bricks for Chris has his own float, guys. So, you know, float. the first float is my Sig Fig float. The second float is Bricks R's float. And this one is for Bricks for Chris. Now, I tried to give you guys a hint. One of my hauls I did, I, I got these blue bricks. And I mentioned that it was going to be for the clowns. Well, the clowns and the jesters are just riding on this float. They don't have anything to do with Bricks for Chris. But this blue, he has a SIG rig that he built that he drives around in his city. And the color scheme is white and this dark blue. So that's why I chose these two colors. This is nothing fancy. My original intention was to take the Octan car. Because you guys, if you watch Bricks for Chris, you know he has about... 15 or 20 different versions of this car where he takes he changes the color scheme up he puts custom stickers on it and he has a bunch of different cars so I wanted to put that as kind of the lead the I don't know what you would call it the headpiece I guess you would say for this float but it was just too big so what I did was when I was a kid I had this little set that when I was a kid there weren't poly bags there were little boxes and I had this little race car that was about, I mean, it's basically what you see there. It had a roll bar on top of a 1x2. might have had a 1x4 there, but I, wheels, a one, a 2x6, a steering wheel. And this, this little slope piece actually was a printed piece. And that was it. That was all that made up the car with the little race car driver. So I put the Octan driver in that car, used that as the headpiece, and I got his championship cup behind him there. And then what I did was I took and I built some little mini houses and some little mini cars because Chris has a fantastic city. And he's always building those Octan cars or those uh, customized cars. And I know those don't look like the Octan cars, but it took me a while to come up with that little design. Uh, I think they're similar to the ones on the Tower Bridge, but I actually had to split them in half. And then I had to figure out how to attach them to the float. So that's what I came up with. There's a couple on each side. And then I got the number four here because it's Bricks for Chris. And this actually will be float number four in my parade. But he was made third. So the next guy I make will be float number three. So who do you think it's going to be, guys? I've already got an idea who it is. I'm not going to share it with you. But I'll let you leave me some comments. Tell me who do you think number three is. So we take a look at this float. You'll see it's pretty much like the other one. Got a couple cars there, a couple houses. Side comes down so I can get the guys in and out. I do need a lot of a lot more clowns for this. You'll see the other side there's a different color cars. Comes down just like on the other one. Number 4 up there for bricks for Chris. Three guys in the well that could probably hold four. One guy up top it, probably hold four and then I got one guy on the back which it could take two and you actually get two guys up here and then the same thing on the other side you see that's how many more people I need to fill this float I could actually Chris is the float lieutenant so the lieutenant always is the first man on the front um, the senior lieutenant is the first man on the front sometimes he's the second guy or sometimes he might be the first guy up here on top so that's what that's it guys that's all for this one real simple mock I just wanted to show it with you guys I just finished it. it took me a little bit longer than I thought because it took me a while to come up with like I said these little mock cars and the little houses could have done some more but you know you got to use this is actually supposed to be a cop car but you got to use the pieces that you have so that's what I came up guys tell me what you think you can check me out on Instagram at Mardi Gras Man 23 You can check Bricks for Chris out. Make sure you check him out. I'm sure if you're watching me, you know all about Bricks for Chris. I will put a link in the description. 
so you guys will be able to go check him out. You can check out my Bricklink store at Mardi Gras Bricks. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Please give me a thumbs up and like the video. And until next time, guys, we'll see you later.